We're gonna talk about the new Snapchat update because I don't even know what to think about it. I think it's honestly interesting. Here's what it looks like. What's up, party peeps? What's up, creators? What's up, entrepreneurs? I feel like that was way too much to kick off today's video. Hey, mom. Hi. But hey, it is currently actually super late. It's 6.30 p.m., quite late for the vlog. I'm headed to LA tomorrow, and I haven't even packed yet. So, <laughs> if you guys know, you know, we're at Chick-fil-A. And we ordered the Diet Strawberry Frozen Lemonade. Try it, you're welcome. Also, random and unpopular opinion. I'm really into music that's like overplayed when it's like driving and happy like chain smokers is that just me so we're at ulta which is the main show of the day you guys know i used to be really into makeup and after just you know being an entrepreneur changed you i'm joking but like i really don't do much in the day i work on meetings and it's all just like a camera or a phone screen so i don't wear much makeup but i'm going to la so i was like why not be bougie so before i tell you guys why i'm going to la i have a coach call students so let me do that first and I'll explain more like you're not targeting any of them that's why you're getting only 50 likes man so what I would do we're at Bed Bath and Beyond just to pick up stuff before I fly tomorrow I'm going to LA my family's marketing agency has a client in LA and then we're going to San Francisco for another meeting and I'm there just to just to observe also the meetups and meetings uh, with friends and entrepreneurs in California. So I actually just hopped off a call with one of you guys. Um, I did this free coaching thing for the longest time on my channel and I had to stop. I actually occasionally still get calls, but I can never turn you guys down. All that hashtag ask Jade spots are like filled up and I'm so sorry, I'm gonna open more soon. So stay tuned for that. Also, look at this, Amazon Alexa, you guys know my obsession with voice. We are working on a few programs and applications for Alexa coming soon. And I know I always say coming soon, but it's just taking forever. It's just been so busy, guys. It's been so busy. I hope you're doing great. Thank you. Thank you. All right, guys, we got the goods. We're back home. I'm packing in the back. Everything is a f***ing mess. And I'll catch you guys the next morning when I'm at the airport. So good night. What's up, you guys? We're at the airport. Our plane boards in like literally three hours to LA but like my dad's like extremely early to everything so we're here like three hours early so this is the outfit of the day so we got airport Gary looks we got Birkenstocks we got and we got wait for it wait for you guys we gotta have the airpods I'm gonna go order my salad and breadsticks oh yeah also you guys um it's crazy to think last time I made like an airport type vlog I was traveling to Europe with like no subscribers. I was like really sad because no one really cared about my videos. So I'm super happy to have you guys. So you guys know I'm really picky with coffee. So let's try this Vietnamese coffee from the airport. Good, right? Holy shoe. It's so good. Mm, mm, mm. But my coffee recipe, guys, is way better. So you should check it out. So we landed in LA, but it's um very, very hot. <laughs> Got the rental car and it's time to go to our hotel and check in. We are here in the hills. I did not dress occasionally for this hot weather. It is like 90 degrees. So I'm not complaining though. I'll catch you guys at the hotel. Guys, this place is really cool. I'll tell you more why I'm here. Is, uh, that, is, that, is that legit enough yeah, for you? Yeah, it's pretty legit. Guys, you can see. You can go yeah. outside. Too. Guys, this is the views of the hotel we're staying at. It's currently 6 p.m. And I thought I'd just tell you guys a little bit of what's going on. Why is Jade here? And a little bit of backstory because so I'm from LA. I was born and raised in LA. We're in Hollywood right now. My dad's marketing agency's client is here. We're having a meeting and we had connections to say in this residential place. My family moved from LA to Texas, Texas to Washington State or Portland, Oregon, where we <laughs> struggled and now we're back in LA which is a little bit crazy I dreamed of going back to California because I mean I just love it here I love the energy it's like the entertainment central and when I was struggling like financially this is all I dreamed about and now I'm like I'm staying in the heart of Hollywood literally on Hollywood Boulevard like that right there is Hollywood Boulevard and I mean I'm just so thankful that I mean God put me here you guys are here and I guess let's talk about snapchat <laughs> the reason why I feel like I'm able to talk about social media and why I'm kind of confident or I guess why the f I chose marketing is just because I feel like I need to share what I know because I've been through a lot of sh 
man like my family started multiple businesses that failed and the one that did pretty well was marketing solely so i have pretty good knowledge on what doesn't work and what does work for the meat of this video we're gonna talk about the new snapchat update because i don't even know what to think about it i think it's honestly interesting here's what it looks like i think the way you use it or the way snapchat wants you to use it is similar to instagram's algorithm they only want you to interact with people that you will genuinely find engagement with does that make sense like basically every single platform is going to have an algorithm i'm going to pop in a article i saw right here that's all about like will instagram go back to chronological order i don't think so at all they're making way more bank from having an algorithm because people are paying more for ads people are also getting more engagement because the content is um, that, that shows up first is what Instagram thinks is what they're gonna like so everything is user friendly and customized for each person so I don't think Instagram's gonna go back Snapchat just made a move on nothing chronological like Snapchat stories are no longer chronological Instagram stories no longer chronological Twitter YouTube Facebook I don't think anyone's going to go back and it's just so they are making more money and users stay on the platform and stay engaged and it sucks for creators but I have a few videos um, below up how to beat the algorithm i mean i don't think you can f beat it it's like a machine you can only put the best content out there and there's ways to like growth hack of course i believe totally in like a lot of little ticks and tricks on instagram hacks i'll link them below if you want to binge some instagram videos but i just thought i'd show you the new update if you haven't heard i want to know comment below right now what do you think about the new snapchat update honestly i don't really like it but i think they're doing a smart move just so people are still on the platform snapchat has actually decreased in engagement and user activity their ceo is probably like shaking so smart move. I want to know what you think though. So comment below right now if you want to be the next comment winner. Shout out to the comment winner. Comment on this post to be featured in the next episode. Anyways guys, I just want to say I'm super thankful for all of you. I hope you have an amazing day. True blessing to have you here. And we're almost at 10k. So smash that subscribe button because um, I love you all so, so much. Catch you guys in the next one. Stay tuned for tomorrow's vlog when I tell you more about why the f I'm in LA. See you guys. What's up guys? Thank you so much for watching. Hold up, if you could do me a huge favor, give this video a like and hit that subscribe button to turn on my post notifications. That would mean the world to me and I really appreciate it. Mwah.